Feature Friday. The freshest. <laughs> incredible that's how i'm gonna start this video incredible just by the title of this video you already know you're in for a treat and it's probably gonna make you question everything you know about breathing it's a philippines longest breath holding and sustained notes while singing uh, it's like a comp compilation that uh, someone sent through uh, i would presume we were gonna see some familiar names perhaps some new ones but i've never seen this and uh, yeah it seems fucking you know, over there oxygen just be different is it you don't need that. Mm. And then in her mouth, she has like a mint. How mad is that, bro? <laughs> How crazy is that? <laughs> a pastille, that's what it's called, pastilles. Yeah. I couldn't think of that word last time. Yeah. But yeah, you should, we should probably add the clip. I mean, I don't know if Corel, I don't know. Everyone knows anyways. Jaya Ramsey. Jaya. And it's not only, uh, have a moment, uh, stop, uh, stop. It's not only that they are, <laughs> holding the note and maintaining a continuous breath flow. No, no, no. They are proceeding to be belting in incredible larynx possessions that also required physical anchoring and also changing into a different note. So the musical singing journey of it, it's absolutely wild. I wish they would have put like the note that they're reaching. Oh yeah, that would have been cool. Eh, stupid. <laughs> Turns out it's just a regime compilation. You see, that's crazy. Ah, oh, Kyla. Wow, Kyla, I had no idea oh. this video existed. No, I know. This is amazing. Oh, oh Charisse. Charisse. She's so anchored from the beginning, right? So, so mad. So incredible. Oh, gosh, that is so full. Lani. Oh, Lani. Whatever second she's gonna hold here, she can go longer. That classical training is no joke, bro. Oh, yeah, bro. it comes in clutch. My God. And she's actually not accessing that classical aspect of things, man. Oh, come on. It's just for Jean. Uh, do you know what you do? Go ahead and she just stands there. So full, damn. This is in the same notes as Regine's last video. I don't know why I want to say that's an F sharp. Probably not. <laughs> <laughs> Literally the most covered <laughs> song I think I've ever seen in one country. Yes, well, that's that's about. Obama one of is who? Uh, 
Shout out GMA. Oh, this is a piece of a cake for her. Mm. Oh, God damn. Put that again. I, I, I like these ones better. Ooh. I like these ones better because obviously range is like... Put that again. Put that again. Go back to that section. Obviously range is, you know, super impressive mm -hmm. and he drives people mad and stuff. To yes. me... um. It's the color that you can provide to these things. And I think that's why she's so like, impressive. Because like range is only one aspect of things. It's yes. not everything. Yeah. So it's like you can have great range, but then have shit texture or not be able to, to tell the right story, mm. not able to connect with the piece. And then it's like, meh. Uh, but if you can have all of them, which, you know, I think every singer that we've checked out right now, Kyla, Jaya, Angeline Quinto, Lani Misa, Lucha, Regine, they all do have that ability. Yes. Hence why they're some of the best in Asia. Uh, but... This this aspect of things, um, it's, it's what so I think is like a true elite. I agree. She's not even anchored. She anchored there. Oh, that's beautiful, bro. Like, what the hell? Oh, so good. Is that Paolo? Piolo, Piolo Pascual. It, it is no. I think it's someone else. Oh, that's really interesting, though. But you see, she was moving. Through, she was moving throughout that whole singing phrase, with one breath. Who the hell is that guy? Mad. Yeah. Who is that? Go, Shireen. <laughs> TFC. They're in Regis. Oh. My God. Yeah, Shout dude, out to that sound dude. engineer as well. Yeah, Sharon yeah. Regis has mad pipes, bro. Mad pipes. And she's such a tiny person. <laughs> mad, bro. Like, it's, yeah. not, it's not even funny. 12 seconds, 12 seconds and a half. How? Oh. Francesca Far. That's a new name. Pretty women as well. We're at 13 right now, right? Like, and we're halfway through. What the hell is the ending? For two minutes? Is it? Uh, you know what's beautiful about that? Yeah, okay, just Cherise. Dude, I'm actually. It also, it also I'm moves so quick as well. <laughs> Overstimulated a little bit, but this is mad because in that in that last clip, you were also seeing that she. This is an easy part of her vocal range. This okay. isn't like one of those comfortable parts of her singing phrase. So she's really just allowing the 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 breath to be sustained, which is tricky though. Because how do you maintain the note to uh, keep the same tension throughout 
without wavering any bit out a little bit more pressure or a little less pressure is just the right amount of air for 13 seconds and a bit that is actually so crazy <laughs> Rocket, rocket. Same technique here. How? Usapan panalo. I give you a line. I feel like we've. I recognize the name, but I really don't. I don't think so. Oh, that sounds so easy. Yeah, to this day, I haven't heard... Pa uh, oh, shit. That's actually perfect. Like, that's why I think she's became so legendary. It was in moments like this. Oh, my God. Where she's like... Sitting down, having a blast. Yeah, whatever. But it's like, it's just the take. It's that, no, it's no, the no. take, it's that song. Yeah. Like, you don't really get singers like that anymore. Yes, I agree. Um, you don't really get moments like that anymore. Mm -hmm. It's like, I'm, I'm, I'm a big believer in like, that's why I tune into uh, sports events and uh, go watch concerts. And even if you're online or in real life, you want to witness greatness. Not only because I'm a big believer that that shit's contagious, um, if you're exposed to that and then you're also obviously putting the work in and whatever, you know, you could, it could inspire you to do something similar to that. But it's so rare in different parts of the world even now to find singers that have those moments of greatness mm -hmm. um, that isn't, full, you know, filled with all the other BS. Yes. You know, that, that, that's a music organic. concert for being a music concert and she is a singer and that's what she does. She sings, yes. nothing else. Um, and she's the best at the world at that, you yeah. know. And I think it, it's it, what's interesting about this. This I think the Filipino music industry overall is that they really provide you with the idea of organic greatness. Like it's yeah. not. It's about the true core essence of the talent itself and how it's been executed. Not about how we're gonna mask it up or put makeup on it. Um, I think it's also that comes after, like way after. I think I think a lot of people from all over the world feel like that. Like you mm. know, in Korean pop, it, people do feel like that. It's like that's why when you watch Shiny for the first time live, yes. you know, in 2000 and I don't know when the fuck, 2009, 10, yeah. um, and they have these amazing concerts, you're like, oh my God, I've just witnessed the first time greatness. That's right. Uh, you want to always witness those ones, the record breaking moments. That's when people watch BTS in Wembley, they're like, oh my <laughs> God, they're the greatest thing I've ever seen in my life because you're witnessing first time greatness. You're witnessing something that is going to be marked in history yeah, forever. When, when you watch you know, like Lata Mangeshkar, if you're like, you know, if you're from like uh, India mm -hmm. um, or, or Japan or yeah. like One OK Rock or yes. uh, in China or like, yeah. Watching you life. You're like, what? Yeah. What is happening? Yeah. In Malaysia, it would be, um, I, I forget her name, but God damn, she's so good. I was listening to her the other day. Abdul. Abdul, what's her name? Ah. Sin, I forget her name. Ah, but she's like a joke and, and she sold out so many places. And she was one of the first Malaysian artists to do so. And then it was like, just, it was like a first time greatness moment in Asia, yeah. you know? I um, mean, the, in the US as well, it's like when you, you know, Mariah Carey in her prime, mm -hmm. uh, you watch that as like witnessing greatness. Or Jesse J life. And you're like, what is happening? Celine Dion. It's yes. like, again, different caliber of people, but it's like Celine Dion is like, when you watch that shit, that was witnessing greatness. Yeah. You know, that wasn't just a concert. That was something else. We watched Pavarotti. When you when you when you watch nowadays like Bocelli, Andrea Bocelli, that's like that's greatness in the flesh and blood. Stevie Wonder, that's like great. You know what I mean? Yes. Uh, and it's rare; those moments don't happen frequently. And in Asia, I definitely feel Regime was one of them. Queen, when you watched Queen, you know. That's a special moment, man. Wow. <laughs> seen all eras of Regine. It's 
She's so full in that tape. What song? Good. Jonah. Jonah. It's an F5. That's an unnaturally a long amount of time. Oh, right here, rush here and go. Go, that's my, she's another, she's another Western queen. <laughs> oh, nasty. You see that that like why? Why? Because I can. Because she can. It's like it's like Because like, why not? It's like Thanos or something when he has all the stones. He could he could just end everyone why like that. Not? It's like why not? Because why not? Poor Mike. Say again, to me that last bit was more important. Literally every era of Regine. This song is actually go going to be the new obsession. So she had moments where she did it longer. How ridiculous is that? Go Jonah, girl. Jimmy. She's so beautiful as well. Yeah, she's a pretty woman. Well, she is, she is what you would call like textbook perfect singing uh, uh, technique. Uh, yes, so she, she is really intriguing then she to have a look at both. how what her breath economy would be like and stuff. Look how incredibly lifted she is in her diaphragm. You can see it up in her chest. Oh, immensely economical for her. Oh, so is the E vowel and the softness of the song. She could get, she could carry on. And she the funny thing is, on. like, you see what I mean? It's like that. That was so much more impactful um, because it, it, you know, it's, it was not the highest. Uh, also, there's ever. a lot of emotional inter intertwining exactly. into so the picture. It does not matter. And, and again, I, when I when I, when we speak to different singers from all over the world. Uh, it's like everyone obviously appreciates this and this is an immense and uh, like an anomaly like a like alien type skill right to be able to hold those notes for that amount of time um but emotional delivery intent connection to the piece yes. texture and colors just you don't have to do this to be a world-class singer these people are just crazy they're they're like that and that that's what i mean it's like it's a compliment because they they're going beyond 
far beyond of what you actually need to do. Um, I guess you could argue with this, like with Jonah, with Lani, you could argue like their classical training does mm -hmm. come in really handy for this. Definitely. With Regine, you could argue that she is genuinely just an alien, like it, that, that's normal, <laughs> you know, it, that it isn't normal. You get people like this every now, every, every now and then in generations. Um, you know, genetics are just genetics and yeah. very rarely that you will have the same vocal predisposition as someone like Regine. Sorry mm -hmm. to crush your dreams, mate, watching. Um, but... Yeah, then like Lea Salonga is like a great example of like, you know, good genes, you know, immense work ethic, but like a very, uh, like an immaculate vocal uh, technical approach to things yes. because of theatre. Um, so it's you're different. It's a very different breed of way of like, there's a different breed, breed of singing. Yeah. It's, when it's, it comes to theater, it's though, like it's a, it, like, I mean, you, you can use theater like influences in, in contemporary singing and modern pop music, but it, to to do it at its core essence, like uh, Rachel go uh, go and and go and 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 uh, Lea Salonga, you got those those really pinnacle moments where like the the te uh, the theater technique comes through, and it's the core reason for it being the way it is. Um, yeah, another another like uh, anomaly, and just with blessed ability from birth would be like Charisse. Um, and now Jake Cyrus. So it's like, yeah, yeah, you do get these individuals that are like blessed from the get go. Yep. Um, obviously, without the training and work and ethic and the uh, ability to execute under pressure, you wouldn't even know of them. But let's presume that they do have this ability, like Cherise, Jake, um, and you know Regine kind of do with those type of larynxes that just it kind of it's inexplicable sometimes yeah but then you see people for example like uh a kyla who are so naturally gifted but they have also put in in an enormous amount of work they stylized it exactly. that, that's the really so, interesting bit so they've they've taken they've taken the extra step to to go um i'm not just going to be encapsulated in this birth gift yeah. that I've received from God, but also style, uh, stylistically speaking, also narrow it, it down. Yeah. Yeah. Kyla's story is really interesting. If you ever seen that podcast we did with her and Jay, I would, uh, Jay, I would highly encourage you to do. It's, um, so it's, it's phenomenal. She's she, the sweetest woman ever. <laughs> yeah, literally. I like, I want her to be part of my family, you know, <laughs> like you want someone like that in your life to be yes. like that sweet and encouraging and understanding and also her story is no easy journey, bro. Oh, like, yes. Her dad was, you know, really believed in her, but that meant a lot of w hard work mm. and a lot of, uh, you know, sacrifices and stuff. So, mad. Inspiring. But yeah, Kyla Inspiring ain't no sure. joke, bro. Yeah. I counted late and I counted 18. Damn. Thank you for watching. Oh my God. Thank you for blowing my mind. That is such a jump though from the what? previous ones. Like 14, 15. Yeah, 21. 28. 21, 21. 21. 21. Oh, okay. 21 I read 28. No, no. My mind. 21 seconds. I told you something. I'll tell you something. It, I, honestly. Damn, so Jonah takes the win. Yeah. Yeah. Again, I think those classical um, uh, singing influences come in clutch. Very clutch. With this, with this type of stuff. I would not. So, well, I would not be surprised if you, there's clips of Lani also doing this. Like 20, I would 15, agree. 15, 20 seconds. Yes, that is madness. Again, let us know what you guys think about it, and who would you put into this list? I'll try. I'm gonna try. Ah!